Grand Rising Collective, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. How are you? There are uh, new readings on the channel. I hope you are having a good weekend. It is Sunday and we're here. We're here. Um, the community tab is open. Again, it's not for everybody, only take what resonates. And um, what's confirmation for you? You can get crazy. It's an aggressive energy in the community tab sometimes because these karmics are crazy, okay? They're crazy. Mm-hmm. All right, let's get into today's message. Let's see what the spirit guides, ancestors, and the divine need us to know. What do they need us to know? Hmm. All right. Taking it easy today. Taking it easy. All right. Let's um. Let's get three cards out of here. All right, something wants to really come out. Something's demanding to come out here. <laughs> we have luck is not on somebody's side and they need to be careful. They haven't told you something. There's something they haven't told you with confession in reverse. And we have four cards here. We have cycles. Somebody is, um, something is ending and something is beginning for someone. They won't move on. They. It's like this person does not want a cycle to end and yours to begin or something. Somebody is sure about their sexuality and maybe somebody has a problem with that. It's like, I'm picking up that maybe you experimented sexually. This is not for everybody. This is a general reading. Only take what resonates with you and what's confirmation for you. But what I see is that maybe someone experimented sexually in the past with this person and this person liked that because they were energy harvesting off of you sexually okay it was it made it made their life easier and better to exploit you or to to control you in that way sexually that they maybe they convinced you into it or they put you onto it or something or some would say turned you out okay but you're not a narcissist not to say that if you have same sex you are a narcissist but this person is a narcissist and you're not that's what i'm saying and um you're not a narcissist 
you're, you're sure about your sexuality and that's bothering somebody. It's like they, they want you to be what, what they want you to be. Um, but maybe someone took time to realize that's not who they are, but maybe they did it for other reasons in the past. And this person cannot move on and close this cycle. They can't let it go. They need to be careful. They're overworking themselves. They're not being honest. And luck is not on their side. Nothing is going in this person's favor because they're too controlling. They're a narcissist and you're not. And it's not working anymore. Maybe at one time, you know, some somebody was was low vibrational. Somebody, you know, sometimes when you're with a narcissist, you can act like this person. Because again, it's like you could be projecting the energy and they could be projecting onto you and then, you know, you're acting out like them. And, you know, sometimes you stoop down to this person's level, you argue with them. That's That happens in relationships. It's nothing, you know, crazy. But maybe this person liked when it was like that because it was toxic and this person is a toxic person. Hmm. They don't want to give. Like this card doesn't want to get off the table. <laughs> what card was that? Mm, government. Court. So somebody's going to court and they don't want, it's like they don't want to get off the table. Like they don't want to get up. They don't want to uh, deal with it is what I see here. It's like somebody feels like they can control their outcome if they can control you. All right. They're just giving you some fake peace shit. This is fake. Okay. It's fake. This person is trying to get their way in court. They could, could have done something to your food. Okay. Or be stalking you. Stalking where you eat or something or doing something to you when it comes to food. <laughs> what else do we need to know about these people? I can't make it up. Somebody was happy when you were involved in this um, this lifestyle sexually, okay? And you are sure now that you're you're not figuring you're not being um, explorative or you're not having same sex relations. It's just you've you've made up your mind. Is what I see here is that. You, you don't want to do that anymore. And somebody's saying yes. Now, this could have something to do with a court case. It could be coming up in court. And somebody is, is, is protesting, having some sort of revolution or uprising about it. It could be bothering someone. Okay, somebody was delving with the devil. Again, not to say if your same sex is the devil. I'm talking about this particular situation. Okay. Somebody was sexually assaulted, okay? So, yeah, this is this is um this is coming up in court. And someone could be same sex. They don't have to be. They could be. Someone was exiled, feels banished, disowned, forced underground maybe, a fire sign. Somebody got burned. A house burning could be significant. A death could have happened. A lost loved one or somebody could have disappeared or vanished. And again, we could be, uh, someone could be involved with a functioning addict. So there's different energy here. Um, When the devil comes out, somebody has some type of sex addiction here or had one or has one and they assaulted someone out of their lack of self-control, I see. Okay. Somebody's experiencing some fire. It's, it's, it's just very hot and uncomfortable. Somebody could have been abandoned or lost their life. 
Hmm. Let's see what's going on here. What do we need to know? Okay, we have Nine of Pentacles. Positive Virgo energy. Okay. Enjoying your fruits of labor. Possibly spending time with the ancestors. Okay. Two of Pentacles in reverse. I'm sorry, in the upright. Mm -hmm. This person is this person is adjusting, okay. After dealing with the sexual assault from this negative fire sign here, Six of Wands in reverse. Somebody who's struggling with their popularity, they could have addictions. Both of these people could have had some sort of addiction, but one person is trying to balance, and the other person is still in reverse here. Just um, struggling with their ego. This is the person that may not want someone to move on here. Maybe somebody was into this girl on girl or guy on guy action. And they again, they liked it that way. And somebody does not want to do that anymore. That's their, that's their prerogative. They don't want to do that. But again, somebody was using you. Right over the sexuality card. Both of them. Somebody was using this opportunity to recover. Five of Pentacles in reverse. They were constantly using this energy to recover and get back financially on their feet. Like I said. Okay. Seven of Pentacles. Okay. We have Taurus energy in a positive. That could have lost a loved one down here in the corner. Okay. More positive Taurus energy, maybe a baby. Something happened behind this person's back. This is the Hierophant card. Okay, but something happened behind this person's back. Maybe it concerned a child. I'm sorry about that. A fire sign could have something to do with it. This person wanted to celebrate by themselves here. Three of Cups, but this person's by themselves. Okay, so they wanted something all to themselves here. Somebody was being greedy. Okay, they didn't want to share something with their friends is what I'm picking up. Like, it's like somebody did something out of greed and didn't want to share anything. Because this Three of Cups, is the, 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 uh, the photo on the back has three people. But the other side has one person, okay, by themselves. So that's how I depict that. Two of Cups in reverse. This is somebody from your past that you broke up with. This this wasn't your person. This not this is not your divine person. But you have. I also am reading this as this Three of Cups with a single person on the front. It is in the upright. This person could be greedy, okay? But I'm also reading this as somebody could have been in a three party and now they just want one person with this single person here by themselves they could be a water sign or earth sign page of swords in reverse this person is stalking because of that this two of cups in reverse is stalking this page of swords in this negative air water is stalking now because you're no longer interested in this uh swinger energy it's like swinger energy uh sex and you know, again, to each its own, but somebody doesn't want to do it anymore. And, and they were only doing it, you know, again, to financially recover off of your energy. That's what it was really about. And this, this Three of Cups card here, this is about love and commitment. There's just one woman in this photo. So somebody just wants one woman and one man is here. Something happened behind this person's back concerning a child. There's an apple here that's split open. It could be fertility. Twins could be relevant. Give me more on this Hierophant card. What happened to this baby? Damn. Okay. Hold on. What happened to this baby? Why is there a baby here in the, in the back of someone? Hmm. 
Knight of Cups. The truth is coming out about something here that somebody something somebody was unaware of. So Scorpio Libra energy did something here. They deceived somebody and now somebody knows. But at the time they were unaware of it with the four cups in the upright. Somebody was disconnected from something or someone and did not know what was going on. Or maybe didn't have clarity on something or was not aware. We have this King of Wands energy and this Queen of Swords energy. The back is turned on the Queen of Swords. So this person did something with their with their face covered is what I see here. Let me clarify these two people here. I don't clarify this Queen of Swords in the upright with their back turn, please. Who is this? Somebody who's avoiding imprisonment or someone who freed themselves. Give me one more card on this Queen of Swords. Okay, Ten of Cups in reverse. Someone could have had a divorce or was having some domestic problems in the family, shattered dreams. Eight of Wands, they were sending out something excessively, angering the divine here, something that was not good. Knight of Wands on the side. Mm. Page of Wands. Hmm. This Queen of Swords is um they are in reverse. They could be telling someone they have nothing to do with this situation. I'm going to clarify this King of Wands in a minute. But this Queen of Swords in reverse could be saying they have nothing to do with this situation. But it looks like they sacrificed someone. And again, face is covered here for a new beginning. But the person who, who they wanted to sacrifice or did sacrifice, their face is not covered. It's known who they are. We have Aquarius, uh, Taurus, Pisces energy. This person is working with a fire sign. This page of wands and this knight of wands. Again, the back is turned. These people are on it, on this channel. They're known to be deceivers right now until further notice. With the eight of wands here and the lightning, whatever they were doing was angering the divine. And someone had a divorce. Somebody separated from this queen of swords, which is Virgo, Libra in reverse. Okay, this person was trying to free themselves from a situation. They could be in jail, but they tried to free themselves with somebody else's new beginning, which is why a child could have been sacrificed. I also, um, let me clarify this King of Wands. These people, I'm telling you, I pick up so much fake energy right now. I'm picking up so much fake energy right now. Like these people, what they're doing they're confusing. They're all their backs are turned here. Somebody's back is turned here. They did something behind this her hierophant's back. Um, a lot of these people are hiding here, hiding their hand. Clarify this King of Wands. I don't trust no damn King of Wands on this channel. Clarify this King of Wands, please. Who is this? What do they do? There, this is. I'm looking at this card. I feel repulsed by this energy. Whatever is on this energy discard is just repulsive. Yeah, Eight of Cups in reverse. They keep coming back, okay? Nine of Cups. Yeah, for your wish fulfillment. They want your wish fulfillment. 
They want your ancestral protection. They keep returning for it. They keep bothering this water energy. Somebody's obsessed with a water sign. Or this person could be fire and water. But they're obsessed with a positive water sign. And possibly this Virgo that first came out and this Taurus in the upright. Th these signs are repulsive. Um, as much as I want to read them in the upright, my intuition is just with these cards underneath. These people are deceivers. And again, with the moon card in reverse, these people are hiding something. Okay, this moon card in reverse gives them away. Something sexual happened here. Okay, and it, give me more on this hierophant in reverse. The hierophant, what happened um, with the child? Emperor in reverse. There they go. Okay. Yep. Four pentacles in reverse. Now that that's the truth here. This emperor in reverse is being greedy. Negative fire energy was being greedy with the magic. Not a good father. Not a good leader. Something happened to a child. Could happen to multiple children. These are multiple people. Um, situations. Four pentacles in reverse. This person is very possessed and possessive. Negative Capricorn energy is involved. Six of Pentacles, more Taurus energy. Again, something is going on behind this person's back. Somebody wants money from this person. They want somebody to share and have charity with them or give them money. Or maybe this person is giving and gave people money before. Again, more backs turned, but this isn't a positive. Somebody, uh, we have Page of Cups and Hermit. This is energy that is, you know, cloaked, um, beautiful. I'm, I'm picking up beautiful feelings here. You know, somebody who just wants to be alone and they're tired of the deception with the moon here. They're tired of... They could be spending time with their animals, okay? But somebody is just doesn't want to be seen right now. Like somebody just wants to be, they want a soul search. Um, they could be contacting intuitively with the Page of Cups. They could be contacting that way instead of in the physical realm because it's just where they feel safer. Um, somebody just wants to be alone with a turtle here. Animals could be relevant. We have ancestors in the corner. Somebody's just going within. Somebody's very spiritual or... Or is tapping into their spirituality and could be just trying to, they're looking somewhere. Where are these people looking? They're avoiding a painful ending with the Ten of Swords in reverse. Confirmation. A father could be relative, relevant. I just saw a father's aid pop up on the phone. Um, seven of cups. Yeah, somebody has, has choices and opportunities. Okay, they could be uh, fantasizing about their future. Maybe they want to do something new. Uh, yeah. And then we have five of wands here. That's, you know, again, trying to cause a painful ending to the seven of cups energy. To this water, earth energy in the positive. This person is here is fighting, okay? Causing eruptions here. And trying to cause a painful ending for somebody. So that they could have a new beginning. This is how these people uh, have their careers, I guess. Yeah, King of Cups is, is, is here though. Ancestors are here. And they're doing something again. Even the ancestors' back is turned here. Okay, because a lot of this, I believe, is taking place in the spiritual realm where you don't physically see people. Even down to what happened to the child could have taken place in the spiritual realm. These people do very corrupt things spiritually. They astral project out of their body and they do these disgusting rituals. Why is King of, why is the ancestor here? What happened? Yeah, somebody was deceiving 
okay, with the seven of, uh, seven of Swords here behind. Again, face is covered. Okay, somebody wants to reconcile with the Six of Cups. They want to get together. <laughs> this card is funny. Somebody's in the water and they're waiting for somebody to come get us. He's like, come and get me out the water. Okay, somebody's flirting here. But these people are doing something deceptive when it comes to these two people getting together. Again, the devil is using this person here. Negative air, negative fire, energy, negative earth, all the elements in the negative here. Somebody's being a spiritual whore, again, in secret with the world card. Okay, somebody could have red hair. Nine of wands. Mm. Somebody keeps um, contacting you. Somebody keeps contacting you. Hmm. They keep trying to possibly, you see somebody here, he, he just looks like he's ready to just mount her or some shit. Like, it's just weird. Okay. For opportunity. Yeah, he's he wants to mount her for opportunity. That's how he's looking at her. Like, she's a piece of meat. Okay. And then we have the star card in reverse here. But again, the back was turned. So we have negative Aquarius also trying to mount somebody like they're a piece of meat. Okay. She don't got no damn clothes on. But again, she's doing things in secret here in the spiritual realm. See the spirit, just the spirit right there. Okay. That's what this person is doing. Knight of Swords in reverse. This is a criminal here. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So we have negative Virgo, negative Capricorn, and Aquarius energy. Okay. They're struggling financially. These people are doing dark things for money with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So they're, they're out here trying to have sex. That's what it looks like to me. For opportunity and they're stalking okay ace of swords says that's the damn truth ancestors bringing you to clarity about what these people are doing in the energy when it comes to the sex they're about to be arrested or under arrest here put to rest however you want to read it but something is about to be calmer because um these people are out of control they're just not um they're not doing the right thing and the difference is people are aware now. So they're just, again, with the devil card here, these people have obsessions and they can't let it go. Yeah. So we have Taurus Gemini energy here in the positive. Somebody's going to be meeting up. This King of Swords is going to be meeting up with their person very soon. With their Empress. We have positive Gemini, Empress, and Queen of Cups could be meeting with their people very soon. Their person. I said people. People, person. Okay. Yeah, somebody's moving on and leaving this uh, this Leo in reverse energy who is not doing well. They're very weak. Okay. They could be sick. If somebody's moving on and they're, they're, not, they're not telling people where they're going. Somebody just wants to go away from this crazy karmic energy. Ace of Cups. Yeah, somebody has new love and this fire sign is upset about it. They're up here causing havoc in the sky. Because somebody has new love or somebody's tapping into their spirituality or intuition. And this fire sign, again, has a problem with it. More negative fire, just fucking crazy and trying to burn down everybody's life because their life is fucked up. Two of swords in reverse. Yeah, making evil decisions. Okay. And again, somebody moved on. A divorce could have taken place here for sure. And this person just keeps making evil decisions. Five of Cups. We have Scorpio who's devastated with fire. Okay? Doing out, out here doing magic and it's causing nothing but loss and grief. This is my funeral card. It's just it's causing nothing but endings. This magic that this person is doing is just, it's corruptive, it's destructive, and it's, it's, it's nothing good coming out of it. Again, this Page of Pentacles. Just one more card here. This lazy, greedy person um, is, is just really... Could be the root of all of this here. The greed with the, the, the lying, the swindling. Uh, I don't know, man. These people are nuts. And they did something to a child here. Um, I have a lot of readings on that if you if you resonate with that. But they definitely have to do with it. And um, that's sad. That's really sad. These people are, they don't care who they have to harm. 
and how they have to do it. And they're mad because you want to leave this. You want to leave and move. You don't want to live like this anymore. They have a problem with that. Like, let's get the letter deck and see. Uh, mm. Okay, so 80 or 95 could be significant or 59 or 8. Uh, Z. Okay, that's all that fell. I didn't have the bag closed. Forty-one, ninety-four, ninety-nine, eighty-nine, six, fifty-two, thirty-two, ninety-nine. W W could be significant. V Z J. F. P, K, E, R, I, and X. Fix. Somebody needs a fix. <laughs> Kirby, Jezebel, Wreck, Fib is here, Perk, Biz. Somebody business could be wrecked. 28, 43, 22, 17. Somebody thought this was a good business plan. M, V, B, D, Q, E, N, and D. Video could be significant. Parker or Park. Beverly could be significant or Bev. Pen, Penny, Ren, Renny, Ridge, Bridge, Fred, Freddy, Reddy, Nix, Nick, Bird,
Yeah, somebody keeps coming back to try to sacrifice somebody here. Yeah, they make an oath to the devil with the three pentacles in reverse. They're making oath to the devil here. Yeah. Somebody keeps trying to come back. Fred, freed, fried. Jez, Jezebel. Bread, breed, Bree, Brianna, Brianna. Reef, Reefa, Keith. Mix, mixed. Okay, Mr. A mister's name could be here. Six of swords in reverse. Somebody cannot move on. They can't let go of the fact that they cannot sacrifice someone. This this is driving this person insane. Um, knife is here. Knife. Mm. Pick. Hmm. Give me more than the Six of Swords in reverse. You have negative air, negative earth, negative water. Yeah, this person just wants to sacrifice you with the Three of Cups here. They want in reverse. They want to, you know, they want to go out. They want to have an orgy. They want to have the sex here. Do drugs, indulge, and do rituals. That's it. Okay, there are Ace of Cups in reverse. They have nothing new coming for them because they're making oaths to the devil right over the Three of Pentacles. And then we have Ace of Wands. Again, somebody just online, okay, looking for somebody to have sex with. That's all this person is fucking doing. And they're using hoes to do it too, okay? These other people who are possessed. Break, brick is here. Brick, break. Pizza or peas, peasy. Free me. Jeffrey, Jeff. Kim. Kin. Two of Swords. Somebody just wants you to close your eyes, okay? They need help. Somebody really needs help here. They're struggling financially. They can't. Somebody's obsessed with shopping and wants to buy some. And the, you know, this is this is what these people do this for. They do this so they can shop and live this. You know, this is just the most disgusting energy. This is why they do this here. So that they can, you know, pink is here. Pink could be significant. Red is here, pink, red. <sighs> hmm. Bryn or Bree. Breeze. FBI, Fiber, Anki, Two of Wands, Two of Swords, Two of Wands. Again, somebody's spending a lot of time on the internet looking for love or something. Uh, they could be connecting with people online. Wanting to travel. Somebody is online and, and wanting to travel towards somebody. 
pink, 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 something with this pink and this red here. Something about pink and red. Clarify pink and red. Somebody could be on a brink. Brink is here. Okay, we have positive Leo. I don't know if this person, this Leo energy is going to be having it. Look like they have an ending here with the stairway to light card. Somebody is looking, okay, somebody is. Somebody could be trying to do this to a, a person in the upright here, a positive Leo. This red and pink, whatever this red and pink energy is, could be a fire sign with a page of wands. Somebody's figuring out a way. Somebody's trying to sacrifice this positive Leo energy. Somebody wants them to go into the light here. This is a divine person. They're going up. Okay, so... This fire sign is trying to figure out a way to do it. They're in reverse, okay? Page of Wands, again, is never in the upright here. Just never. Um, clarify this Page of Wands in, in reverse, please. Why are they bothering this positive Leo energy and trying to send them to the damn light? Five of Swords in reverse. They've been defeated. Okay, they've been defeated. It hurts. They're embarrassed. Okay, so they're trying to reconcile and bring you a page, a, a, a letter, some kind of communication. Okay, but again, it's to send you to the light. They could be trying to contact you intuitively. You could be a positive water sign, fire. Okay, you're telling this person to leave you alone. Okay, they're also involved with a Queen of Cups in reverse. And you're telling this person to back off. I don't want to be bothered with you. Stop coming around me. All right, they just want charity. Hello. They want you to put something in their uh, their cup here, their uh, charity bin. Taurus energy, Six of Pentacles. Negative Cancer, Gemini. Negative Gemini. Negative Aquarius. Negative Fire. Wives is here. Somebody could have wives. Or wife is here. This person, your ex, possibly somebody who you were with. Maybe it was just about sex or maybe it was for them. They're trying to avoid a painful ending, which is going to happen. The Ten of Swords. X could be significant. Again, more light, people going into the light here, having some sort of ending. It's like somebody's trying to take someone out here and they're trying to do it intuitively, like they're trying to do it without being seen. Yeah. So again, somebody's targeting positive Leo energy, Scorpio energy and Capricorn energy, okay? You could be hiding from this person, you could be traveling somewhere like, they just don't want you to have fun. They don't want you to live your life here. They don't want you to say this person is just, again, ancestors are getting in reverse, okay? For your will of fortune, for your destiny. This is your destiny and ancestors have to get in reverse and, and defend you because this person here who's under judgment, okay? Can't stop stalking. Somebody's just all about, you know, this life here. But they're really a five of cups. This fire water energy is really just a five of cups. They're having loss and grief unless they can take from you. Okay? You could be starting a business or something. If somebody watches you when you're at work. Clarify somebody watches you when you're at work. Clarify somebody watches you when you're at work. Who is doing this? Yeah, you're a Capricorn, possibly Scorpio. You could avoid it. You could have avoided an ending with this person when you release them. 
Capricorn Scorpio, somebody's watching you at work, whether you work online, whether you work somewhere physically, they're watching you. Who else are they doing this to? A Scorpio could be watching you. A Capricorn could be watching you. You could be a Scorpio or a Capricorn. Six of Wands. Yeah, this person in the public eye here. Yeah, I can't make it up. Negative Virgo. Again, somebody's in the public eye. And this negative Virgo is obsessed here. Scorpio negative. Capricorn negative. Again, they're a negative water doing this as well. There are 10 of cups in reverse. And you're not. Okay, somebody's stalking to see when you're gonna meet up with your person. Okay, I'm telling you, they're watching you at work and they want it's like something that they're they're watching to see, okay, how close you are to meeting up with your two of cups. These people, I'm telling you, they're sick. Why why are they stalking this two of cups here? Why, why are they waiting for this two of cups to meet up? Why are they waiting for this two of cups to meet up? Yeah, they want to make some sort of uh, deal with you here. Somebody's trying to make a contract with you. Eight of cups, see? See what's happening in this photo? They're trying to poison somebody when you go out. I'm I cannot make it up. I cannot make it up to you. I can't, they want to know where you go out to eat or something. Eat at home. Okay, this person is crazy. Knight of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they're trying to bring some, some toxic love. They want to join in on your on your relationship. See, so too many people at the table here. Okay, somebody don't have anybody though. Yep. Mm -hmm. You disconnected from this ex. Okay, this is the ex doing this here. Two of Pentacles. Okay, Capricorn, positive Capricorn energy. They could be watching when you go out here confirmation okay you don't you don't want to deal with this person they're trying to keep bringing you gifts you don't want nothing to do with them because they're not a good person but they're stalking you yeah this negative fire sign see stalking you online again very anxious here very impulsive eight of pentacles in reverse lazy ass virgo okay the truth is coming down about this person could have something to do with a house a scorpio somebody spying with a flashlight being nosy breaking into something they're avoiding the cops, this queen of pentacles in, in a verse, avoiding the police, avoiding conflict, some sort of group, okay? Maybe when they go out, they're avoiding, they, you know, they're trying to hide or something because these people are guilty. Yeah, all of these cards are in reverse. These people are guilty and they're just, I don't know why these people just won't fucking go away. Anyway, I'll see you on the next reading collective.